Chief Executive John Lee announced the two giant pandas gifted by central authorities to Hong Kong will arrive in the city on Thursday. The, the two national treasures are both five years old. Residents can expect to meet the animals in the middle of December. Authorities will organize a series of events celebrating the arrival of the pandas. Timothy Lee tells us more. The latest photos of the two giant pandas gifted by the central government to Hong Kong have been revealed. Both were born in June 2019. Ke Ke, the female panda, was seen stepping on top of a stone and playfully sticking out her tongue, while An An, the male panda, could be seen walking around and relaxing at the giant panda reserve in Sichuan. This as Chief Executive John Lee shared some of the national treasure's characteristics earlier today, saying that both pandas are filled with life. An -an. The male is An An, weighing about 130 kilo kilograms. He's agile and energetic. The female is currently called Ke Ke, weighing 100 kilo kilograms. She loves to climb and has a very tender temperament. An An and Ke Ke are set to arrive in the city on Thursday, and they will be welcomed at the airport before they are quarantined at Ocean Park. Residents could expect to see them in the middle of December. The chief executive also noted the two animals will be renamed in October and invited residents to suggest meaningful and creative names. The name An An is not unfamiliar to the city, as another male panda named An An had resided in Hong Kong for 23 years, before he died at the age of 35 in 2022. Regarding the two baby pandas born to giant panda Ying Ying, the CEO hopes they could meet the public by the beginning of next year. He said there will be also a public naming event for the Panda Twins sometime in the future. Meanwhile, the Hong Kong Jockey Club announced it has approved and donated over $121 million to Ocean Park to help upgrade animal habitats within the park's giant panda facilities. Timothy Lee, TV News.